Here are some tips for leading culture change. Every organization has a culture. Every culture has some dysfunction, and every leader wants to change the culture. But cultures fight back. So most leaders end up just giving up on making culture change. It's too hard. But good leaders don't stop at least wanting to try to make things better. So here's a tip. Don't change the culture. Nudge it constantly. After all, your company's culture is bigger than a battleship. This is the wisdom of great books like Nudge and Influencer distilled to its essence. So here's how you nudge your culture. First, choose one behavior at a time to nudge and to change. Second, choose the smallest behavior that's going to have the biggest impact and provide clear guidance for what it looks like when this behavior has changed. You'd be surprised how hard it is to describe the positive outcome you're looking for instead of criticize the negative aspects of what's happening today. And that's where the leader excels. You'd be able to help people envision this better future that this little nudge will produce for them and then give them guidance on how to achieve it. Third, focus everyone on infusing this new behavior into their work days and help them make it their own. Fourth, let it take the time it takes. If it takes a few months, if it takes a year, that's fine. Keep focusing on that nudge until it takes. And number five, choose a new behavior to begin nudging the culture towards and only when that first behavior has become part of the culture. And number six, never stop this cycle. This is not a quick win, but you'd be surprised that after a year or two of these little nudges integrating into the culture, how quickly you've developed a learning culture and a changing culture that is capable of adapting to differences in the environment that you encounter and working its way ever closer to an extremely high-performance organization. So what's your tip for culture change?